Good morning. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those that are new, my name is Becca and the purpose of my channel is to highlight what I eat and how I cook being plant-based. If you're wanting to eat more whole foods or just interested in what exactly a plant-based diet looks like, make sure you subscribe below. I'm starting my morning with a scoop of athletic greens and some vitamin D on an empty stomach. After I drink this, I'll turn on a motivational podcast and start cooking breakfast. For breakfast, I'm making a chickpea omelet. First, I'm gonna wash the veggies I'll use and then make the batter, which is just chickpea flour, water, nutritional yeast, turmeric, salt, and pepper. Now I'll just set that aside while I start prepping my veggies. You can use whatever your heart desires for this omelet for the vegetables, but this morning I had a red pepper, poblano pepper, and a zucchini that were calling my name. So I quickly chopped those up as I warmed a pan and then started cooking them. Now, I don't saute my vegetables in oil. I just heat the pan until it's very, very hot, then add my vegetables, and once they become sticky, I will caramelize them with some water. And yes, I use my drinking water because, well, I'm gonna be the only one eating this. Once the veggies are cooked, I will add them to my batter, give it a mix, clean the hot pan I was using, and then pour it back on to cook. I had some homemade plant-based queso left over, which I thought would make a great addition to this omelet. So I scooped some out and spread it over the uncooked side of the omelet. I do like my omelets to be a little runny on the inside, so before it all cooked through, I folded it over and called it good. To top this off, I added avocado and everything but the bagel seasoning.
about 20 minutes after breakfast, I laced up my shoes and did a Peloton run. Now, I'm someone who cannot work out on an empty stomach. I need to have fuel in my body to be able to have a good workout. And I also need to fuel my body immediately after I work out as well. So props to you who can work out on an empty stomach. <laughs> After my workout and before I got cleaned up for the day, I made myself a quick and easy banana oat smoothie. I just used a banana, organic oat milk, two tablespoons of ground flaxseed, and organic oats. For lunch I made a chickpea salad. First I just drain and rinse the chickpeas and then grab a dish, pour them in and mash them up a little bit using a fork. Now you can do this in a food processor but I just chose to do it by hand today. After you get those all mashed up, I had about four ribs of celery and probably about a quarter cup of red onion and pickles, chop them all up, set them aside. And then add in our Dijon mustard, maple syrup, lemon juice, and tahini. Once that's all mixed, add in the veggies and of course salt and pepper. To make the sandwich, I double toasted frozen Ezekiel bread. I find it makes the bread taste better and seem less dry if you double toast it. And then on the side, I splurged a little and had some of those amazing chips from Trader Joe's.
All right, now it's dinner time. Tonight I made veggie quesadillas with frozen vegetables, black beans, and that same leftover queso I had for breakfast. This dinner is super simple, especially if you are using frozen veggies. All you need to do is warm them up, add the spices, black beans, and then basically just put the quesadilla together.